Hello friends and strangers, I am Heli and this is Rune Factory 5 where we are just starting a new day. Good morning. Good morning. Um, it's still so early. Did something happen? Yes. Special orders just came in from headquarters. Um, that sounds heavy. What's the order? Yes. Our task is to locate a man who's wanted for poaching rune energy. Huh? A rune poacher. Huh? You don't mean... Yes. It's Oswald. Why? Just as you thought. Huh? Which means he was the man with the dark dragon in the Meline crystal caverns. Yes. That seems likely. I'll give you a full briefing in the field captain's office. Mm -hmm. So Oswald really did escape? Yes. Reporting in. CDHQ conducted a thorough search, but ultimately they couldn't track him down. That's... So they've placed him on a wanted list. Let's be off then. Should we prepare to launch a search? Well, no. I don't think that'll be necessary. Why? Really? Why not? Mm -hmm. The area they've assigned us to survey is extremely dangerous. Um... Oh, where is it? A tall's end. Yes. That place is cursed. Normally it's off limits even to see its finest rangers. <sighs> Do you mean cursed? Metaphorically or...? Yes. Those who enter go mad if they manage to make it out alive at all. That's... Their hair turns white, or they come back mute, or they lose their sight. Needless to say, it's shrouded in sinister rumors. Uh, um, Surely there's no way that Oswald would hole up in a place like that, right? Yeah. Well then, guess we're back to square one. Well, no. I'm afraid you misunderstand us. Uh, Oswald has a good reason to take that risk, curse or no. Huh? What do you mean? Yes. Inside a tall's end is a rune spot of the same elemental affinity as the dark dragon. Right. Were he to absorb the rune energy there, he could transfer incalculable power to his draconic partner in crime. Ah. For a fugitive, with the law on his heels and his back to the wall, it's a surefire shot at turning the tables. Oh. If he gained enough power, he could fall off the grid for good, or even take the fight to see it itself. Um. But if that's the case, then I wonder why he didn't make a beeline for a tall's end from the beginning. Mm -hmm. I'm confident that he went only as a last resort. He likely had no interest in braving those dangers. Until now. <sighs> uh, I see. <gasps> I'll go. What? No, the place is cursed. You said it yourself. Yes. If there's even a chance that Oswald will so show his face, then it's my obligation to be there. Well, I... After all, we are rangers of seed. Mm -hmm. Are you okay, Scarlet? Your legs are shaking. This is... I am merely trembling with excitement. Now then. And what'll you do, Hazel? Oh, of course I'll go with her. I 
just can't let Scarlet go alone. Huh? Thank you, Hazel. <laughs> Fine, but please, don't bite off more than you can chew. Hey! And just a moment, Scarlet. I need to tell you something. Understood. So, that's where we'll be going, eventually. Um, for now though, we'll start our day as we usually do. Our little town today. Hello, Livia. This is the third time someone's moved in since you arrived. Think you can find us another two or three new neighbors? It's not like I'm running around trying to recruit people, you know. Have a potion. And we're off to look after our fields. But first, let's see about this and if there's anything we want to do with our points. An all-in-one cooking table. Ooh, 5,000 points though. Let's save up for this. It'll be so incredibly convenient. There are so many of those little add-ons to the cooking table that if we were able to combine them to do all of our cooking at just one table. That'll be super nice. Okay, let's gather up these herbs. Also, Come 8 a.m., we'll see how much we manage to earn shipping that stuff yesterday. Hopefully, it'll get us close to the 8,000 we need. Looks like there are more tomatoes for us to harvest. Really, game? There we go. Oh. I guess there was like a... No, there was nothing there. Hmm. Oh, well, the uh, targeting in this game is sometimes a bit weird. Let's get these tomatoes. And, of course, we'll water the plants too. Huh? Oh yeah, this is a new watering can. So of course, it starts out as empty. That's the withered grass. And the weeds. And there are some grasses too. A little more material stone. Oh, I guess I have to put this away first. Now we'll get that stone. Nice, nice. And moving on to lumber. There's this. And was there a second stump? 
No, I guess it's just a couple of branches. Nice. Yes. Let's put away the uh, weeds and withered grass. And the lumber and material stone. And off to the farm dragon we go. At some point, we'll have to investigate that fire dragon thing. Yes! Do we really just have access to it or or what? All right. Nice. All right. Yes! Nice. It's weird that there didn't seem to be nice. any kind of um any kind of like notice about that. The game didn't tell us that we had got access to yes. another nice. farm dragon. And looks like we kind of overshot it a little with the uh, shipping. We have yes. like eleven nice. and a half thousand. Nice. So yeah, we'll be able to get that bakery upgrade, no problem. Hey, thanks a bunch for shipping that. Well, no problem. It was just a nice. potato. Um... Oh, I guess I have to put this away. Use nutrients. Okay. Let's do it. Hi Hazel, have you ever used nutrients before? If you sprinkle some on your soil, your crops will grow better. Try using this sometime, if you like. Formula A. Well, let's go do it. I assume, I assume that, um, these are for this field and not for the farm dragon because the uh, crystals are for the farm dragon the uh, huge big uh, crystals so i'm using it here how are you growing Alright, let's go and get our reward. Nice job, Hazel. I bet your crops feel so happy now. You can give your crops all sorts of different nutrients, so you should experiment with more of them sometime. If you ever want to check how the nutrients have affected your crops, then you should buy a magnifying glass from the general store. Oh yeah, the magnifying glass. Yes! I guess you don't get it for free. Make more shipments. Bigger bag. Well, yeah. Let's do it. Hey Hazel, have you been keeping an eye on your shipping rate? No. You'll complete more of your shipping list as you ship a greater variety of items. Think of it as measuring how much effort you've put into your work. I know that you work really hard already. Hazel, 
so I bet that increasing your shipping rate to 10% would be super easy for you. If you haven't raised it that high yet, then you should definitely try. I never expected anything less from you, Hazel. Keep working hard and raise it even higher. Oh yeah, larger bag. We'll have to check it out. Prepare for a typhoon. Well, let's do it. I think a typhoon is going to hit us very soon. Sorry to spring this on you all of a sudden, but I'd like you to sprinkle some wettable powder on your fields. That should prevent your crops from blowing away. Let's go use it. I assume it's for the entire Here. field. Go. Greeny fire. So does the greeny fire permanently increase the soil quality? Or just for the current crops. Good work! Now your field should weather a typhoon or blizzard just fine. I actually have a little bit of this left over, so you should take it. Thank you. All right. Upgrade staff. Let's do it. You probably already know that you need a staff to use magic. But did you know that you can upgrade staves too? Upgrading a staff will give it all sorts of effects that you won't find on other weapons. Try it out sometime. I'll try it right now. Upgrade and hmm, this stuff. What should we use to do the upgrade? Magic attack. Defense, magic defense. Hmm. I guess having even a small chance to Resist a stun would be nice. But, um, more magic attack would be nice too. Maybe we'll go with the uh, defensive buffs though. Defense, magic defense and stun resist. Yeah. Done. Let's go see the completion. Staves gain another charge attack level every time you upgrade them. And if you upgrade them with monster materials, you'll change their charge attack as well. So, why don't you try it out? Berry dust. 
What's next? <gasps> Tame a monster. Yeah, let's do it. Do you know how to tame monsters? You just have to give them food you've cooked or items as presents. If they like what you're offering, then you'll have a new friend in no time. Just watch your level. You'll have a much harder time trying to befriend a monster that's stronger than you. Also, monsters won't join you if your bonds are full. So keep an eye on them. I kind of already have an idea of um, what monster I want to befriend. A woolly would be nice for the for the uh, wool, but a chicken would be nice also. For the eggs. Skill up. So maybe we'll try to befriend a chicken today. See how it goes. Yes. That nice. all of all the right. uh, stone nice. all right. here. Nice. All right. Yeah, looks like it is. Okay. Any more? Any more branches? I guess there are a couple. Let's also water these. Watering time. I hope it comes out okay. Watering time. A few we'll make more. It strong, okay. I guess the uh, carrot isn't going to grow in the spring or is it because it still hasn't it still hasn't grown at all hmm we'll see i wonder if the chickens will like my pickled turnips Before we go though, let's go buy some recipe bread and uh, maybe also do the renovation. Oh, off to work. Have Hello, fun. Priscilla. Lucas told me he likes books. I'm so glad that another bookworm has moved in. Do you think he'd mind if I gave him a list of recommendations? I don't think he'd mind at all. Let's get some weapon and crafting bread. That's it. Oops, sorry, didn't mean to water your counter. Yuki, have a potion too. And how are you doing today? Oh, that Lucas. He knows so much, even more than Randolph and myself. I've lived in Rickbath my entire life, you know. I can hardly wait to ask him all sorts of questions about the rest of the world.
Well, I... I hope his memory is... intact enough for him to be able to answer. Learn the straw hat. And... Lance Plus. And Double Scratch. That's a weird name for a dual blade. Let's go get that renovation. I wonder, does it happen straight away or overnight? I guess we'll see. Hello, Rika. I see you're full of energy. So that Lucas guy is moving in, huh? I'm gonna figure out the trick behind those tacky miracles of his. Just you watch. Well, when you figure it out, let me know, Welcome. okay? Um... Oh yeah, this consumes Take those time. points, too. Come again, if you feel like it anyway. It'll be worth it though, to be able to buy new outfits. Pamu, hi. It's a miracle what marvelous magic Lucas wields, and they say he is moving in too. I'm over the moon, over it and twice around it. I will watch his performances each and every day. Ah, Pamo. He's pretty adorable, isn't he? Array of sunshine. Let's go see about the outfits. Can we already buy them? Priscilla, do you know anything? No. Yuki? My, my, if it isn't Hazel. Hello, Yuki. I just wanted to let you know how much I appreciate everything you've done for us. You're the one who, re who expanded our little bakery, right? Thank you so much, dear. You're very welcome. At long last, I can finally fulfill my dream of selling clothes now. I made sure to stock a few things in your size, so please take a look and see what you think. Oh, I will. Absolutely I will. Let's see those outfits. Can we not see them before buying? Thirty six thousand. Wow. Um, <laughs> I don't have that kind of money. Pop casual. That's something I can afford. I guess I'll have to buy these blind.
Oh, right, right. No more money. Hmm. Well, we'll just have to collect them all, I guess. Let's go see what we just bought. That's weird that we have to buy this blind. Oh, that's very pastel. Well, I guess we may sometimes end up with a hat that looks good with a very pastel outfit like that. For now though, we'll keep wearing this. And let's take a look at this straw hat. Hmm. Our fancy hat is better. So, maybe let's not bother making the straw hat. Although, I guess if we make it and ship it, it'll be one more item shipped. Huh. Well, it's not as good as Frost Edge, but it's non elemental. Pack scratchers. Huh. Okay. Well, let's go and see if we can tame us a chicken. Where were they? Ah, yes, here on the right. We'll get rid of these two so that we can then work on the third one in peace. Let's brush it a little. I think there, we there, should there, keep there, brushing there, there, until there, there, we no longer there, get any musical there, there, notes. There, there. There, there. There, there. There, there. There, there. There, there. There. No more notes. And... Time to eat! Oops. Wrong button. There! Oh, it worked! Wow! Um... Name... Let's call you... Um, Poppy? Poppy the chicken? Sure. The thing is though, we don't really want you with us when we go fighting monsters. Um, because the monsters we'll be fighting will be so much stronger than you. So we don't really want to expose you to any danger. Oh, 
I guess we could have... Um, you did a good job taming that monster. Now that you've befriended one, I want you to have this. It's some fodder. Store it in one of your fodder bins and feed your monster friends every day to keep them happy. You can grow fodder yourself after you've purchased some fodder seeds. What I gave you should help you get started, but you'll have to start growing more before it runs out. Got it? I think we already have some fodder growing here. Yeah, I, I guess I could have teleported straight over here to see the monster, but oh well, at least we have now finished the quest, cleared it off the task board and got the reward. So I guess doing it this way was um, the right call. We already got an egg. So can we pet you? No. Ah, okay. So we need to need to befriend Poppy a little more. How do we do that? There, there. There, there. Is it there, just there. that we need to have Poppy with us? There, there. For a set amount of time? Maybe. Hmm. Well, I'm sure we'll figure it out. In the meantime, at least we now have a source of eggs. Let's put away the um, lumber and material stone. And the uh, herbs that we picked up. Fairy dust. I guess before we end the episode, let's put the uh, food items or the uh, food ingredients away. And um, see if we can make some potions. The um, region that we need to go to next. I've already forgotten its name. Anyway, the place we need to go to next sounded pretty dangerous. So I guess it's good to have some potions with us when we go there.
maybe we'll take a look in next episode. There. Now we are all stocked up on potions. And yeah, maybe we'll take a look at that new area in next episode. For now though, oops, um, let's save the game here and um, continue from this point next time. Thank you so much for spending time with me here on the Mellow. It was lovely to have you. If you'd like to show some support, please leave this video a like and perhaps a comment too. I'd really appreciate that. And if you're not already subscribed, then please do subscribe to conveniently keep up with my content and to show me that you want to keep watching my videos. Remember to be kind to yourself. Have a lovely rest of your day. And I'll see you next time.